Hello and welcome to a new video. In this video we are going to talk about the top 10 greatest footballers of all time. Before we begin. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Number 10. David Beckham. David Robert Joseph Beckham is, born May 2, 1975, is an English former professional footballer, the current president and co-owner of Inter Miami CF and co-owner of Salford City. He played for Manchester United, Preston North End, Real Madrid, Milan, LA Galaxy, Paris Saint-Germain and the England national team, for which he held the appearance record for an outfield player until 2016. He is the first English player to win league titles in four countries, England, Spain, the United States and France. He retired in May 2013 after a 20-year career, during which he won 19 major trophies. Number 9. Franz Beckenbauer Franz Anton Beckenbauer, born September 11, 1945, is a German former professional footballer and manager. Early in his playing career he was nicknamed Der Kaiser because of his elegant style, dominance and leadership on the field, and also as his first name Franz is reminiscent of the Austrian emperors. He is widely regarded to be one of the greatest players in the history of the sport. A versatile player who started out as a midfielder, Beckenbauer made his name as a central defender. He is often credited as having invented the role of the modern sweeper, Libero. Number 8. Ronaldinho. Ronaldo de Assis Moreira, born March 21, 1980, commonly known as Ronaldinho Gaucho or simply Ronaldinho, is a Brazilian former professional footballer and current ambassador for Barcelona. He played mostly as an attacking midfielder, but was also deployed as a winger. Often considered one of the best players of his generation and regarded by many as one of the greatest of all time, Ronaldinho won two FIFA World Player of the Year awards and a Ballon d'Or. A global icon of the sport, he was renowned for his technical skills, creativity and dribbling ability, as well as his use of tricks, feints, overhead kicks, no-look passes and accuracy from free kicks. Number 7. Ronaldo. Ronaldo Luis Nazario de Lima. Ronaldo Luis Nazario de Lima, commonly known as Ronaldo, is a Brazilian business owner, president of La Liga club Real Valladolid, and a retired professional footballer who played as a striker. Popularly dubbed in Portuguese O Fenomeno, the phenomenon, he is widely considered one of the greatest players of all time. As a multifunctional striker who brought a new dimension to the position, Ronaldo has been the influence for a generation of strikers that have followed. His individual accolades include being named FIFA World Player of the Year three times and winning two Ballon d'Or awards. Number 6. Johan Cruyff. Hendrik Johannes Johan Cruyff, April 25, 1947 to March 24, 2016, was a Dutch professional football player and coach. As a player, he won the Ballon d'Or three times, in 1971, 1973, and 1974. Cruyff was a proponent of the football philosophy known as total football explored by Rhinus Michaels, and is widely regarded as one of the greatest and the most prolific players in the history of the sport. Number 5. Zinedine Zidane. Zinedine Yazid Zidane, nicknamed Zizou, born June 23, 1972, is it as a French former professional football player who played as an attacking midfielder. He received many individual accolades as a player, including being named FIFA World Player of the Year in 1998, 2000 and 2003, and winning the 1998 Ballon d'Or. He is the current manager of Real Madrid. Number 4. Cristiano Ronaldo Cristiano Ronaldo dos Santos Aveiro, born February 5, 1985, is a Portuguese professional footballer who plays as a forward for Serie A club Juventus and captains the Portugal national team. Number 3. Pelé Edson Arantes do Nascimento, known as Pelé, was a Brazilian professional footballer who played as a forward. 
In 1999, he was named Athlete of the Century by the International Olympic Committee and was included in the time list of the 100 most important people of the 20th century. In 2000, Pele was voted World Player of the Century by the International Federation of Football History and Statistics, IFFHS, and was one of the two joint winners of the FIFA Player of the Century. Maintained the, the GOAT title for about 50 years until Messi and Ronaldo started making a name for themselves. Only people who watched him as kids know why, and this is why he stayed as the GOAT for so long. Number 2 Lionel Messi Lionel Andres Leo Messi, born June 24, 1987, is an Argentine professional footballer who plays as a forward for Spanish club Barcelona. He is also known as one of the greatest football players of all time. He was born in Rosario, Argentina, on June 24, 1987. Zidane, Pele, Maradona, Ronaldo, are nine. The rest of those legends. They have all impacted the football world, but Messi is something else. When Ronaldinho first played with him, he saw that he was going to be the best. He saw that he had more potential than anyone ever. Now it's 2023, and he has won absolutely everything. He is better than anyone he's ever played with, and anyone who's ever lived. He is the one and only GOAT. Numer 1 Diego Maradona Diego Armando Maradona, October 30, 1960 to November 25, 2020, was an Argentine professional footballer. Widely regarded as one of the greatest players in the history of the sport, he was one of the two joint winners of the FIFA Player of the 20th Century Award. Maradona was given the nickname El Pibe de Aro, the Golden Boy. He was known for the goal of the century and the hand of God goal. He died of cardiac arrest on November 25, 2020, at the age of 60. Maradona truly is on his own level of skill. People may argue that he wasn't a complete well rounded player like Pele or Cristiano Ronaldo, but soccer is a sport that is more than just speed and strength. This isn't track and field. What makes Maradona so amazing is that no one else on the world can do what he can with a soccer ball. What Zidane could do with a ball, Maradona could do with an orange. His mastery of the ball makes him the greatest soccer player of all time. Not only could he dribble past Cristiano Ronaldo or anyone else with disturbing ease, but he could also distribute the ball with pinpoint accuracy. This means that not only could he carry a team on his back, unlike Messi sadly, but he also makes his teammates play better. He is a player that you cannot leave on the bench even injured. If you gave Maradona's left leg to any player, they would instantly get on this list. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos. And I see you by the next video.